In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the quick unboxing and a complete setup of your Canon CanoScan LED 400 scanner. So let's do the unboxing and we'll start the setup process. So this comes with the USB data cable. Also it has a stand. That's the manual with the DVD drive. Here we have the buttons in the front. That's the scanner. That's the back of the scanner where the USB connection will be set up and before we start using it we have to unlock it, move it up. So this goes here like this and there is a lock at the back. Now we can keep it like this so that will just save the space for the storage once you want to use it you can just unplug from here and we can place it here. I'm going to set up with my Windows 10 laptop. Go to the Windows screen and open the web browser. Go to the web browser and type in ij.start.canon. Select it. Go down and look for the Canon website and Canon official manuals welcome. Once you open it, it says setup start here. Type in 400 and you will see LIDE 400. Click go and you get setup option here and it displays windows on the top. So make sure you select the windows and click on the download button. Open file. Yes. Start setup. Next, click yes and agree for the terms and conditions. Now we have to connect our scanner with this Windows laptop. So go to the scanner. At the back of the scanner we have to insert this cable. So that's the USB-C connection. Connect other end to your laptop. Connection is set up. Now go to your laptop and finish the installation. Click next. Exit. Close all the web browsers. Now go to the start button. Click all apps. Go to the Canon. Canon utilities. Select IJ scan utility. So let's start scanning. So once you see the Canon IJ scan utility, we can start the scanning and you should be able to see your scanner that is 400. Place a document in the scanner for scanning. Close it. Now go to your Windows laptop and click on the document. It will start the scanning process. Scan is complete. Now we can place the second page. So you can do the multiple scannings. If you have only one page, you can just finish it. Click on the scan icon. Click exit. The scan quality is really good, it's very clear. 
now you can save it so go to the file save as select the file name location and you can select if it's a PDF as a multiple page and then click on the save button so this way we can do the complete setup of the scanner and we can start using it for scanning documents in the same way you can scan the photos thanks for watching